is flat. The truth about Earth. <laughs> um, can we just hope the Earth is flat? Well, that's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. All right, so I thought Sammy Watkins' take about the Earth being flat was funny. Didn't realize it would set the social media world on fire today. Here's how it went down. Turn to more philosophical things. I said, Sammy, you're not one of those guys who thinks the Earth is flat, are you? And he goes, well, yeah, I do. And I said, Sammy. And he said, I, I do. And I said, I'm tweeting this. And he said, okay. And I said, ask him a couple more times, like, Sammy, really? And he goes, yeah, okay. So I tweeted it. There's the tweet, it's out there. Um, lo and behold, I didn't write like a thousand word article on it because, you know, there's other things to report about. This is the new goal. something. Yeah, this is, this is new. Uh, I'm kind of into real estate now. <laughs> Floating away from the suit. And, uh, you know, that's generally what that is. I've never seen any kind of air bubble anywhere. Yeah. Could it, could it be that you're filming in an underwater pool and you're not really out there? The flat earth? Look up bubbles in space, hashtag bubbles in space. Thank you very much. There's the big question really actually is, why do you think the world's flat? Evolution isn't real. We'll yeah. talk about flat earth tonight, all right. <laughs> NASA, light world, the world is flat. And basically there's like an outside wall, which is full of ice. Fall off. I have been around the world, and I didn't fall off. Dr. So you must imagine a spherical, 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 spherical. Why did an Earth-like planet get converted? So let's put that in perspective. If you could point a laser beam with that accuracy and put that laser beam on top of the Washington Monument, you could fire a pulse of that laser all the way to New York City, 200 miles away and hit a dime on the top of the Empire State Building, but not just hit the dime, keep the laser pointed at Roosevelt's head on the dime. That's what point zero zero seven arc seconds is. Said said this, flat. That was, Thousands I'm of saying scientists the same have looked into it. You think they're all wrong? So, so you spin, you know, when you spin pizza dough, it kind of flattens out. So it's not actually a sphere. It's not actually a sphere. Again, 66.6 .6 degrees off. To look into it. Well, Earth is supposedly orbiting around the sun. Hands back. You're going to see that boat and that buoy disappear right here. There you go. Gone out of sight. Not around the so called ball Earth. It's all due to perspective. That simple. And that is, that's, in my opinion, is what the, uh, the globular Earth theorists have done. They've just eliminated what they didn't know. The more honest approach is the flat Earth approach, where you say, well, we don't know what's at the ends, but, but the ends are there. We built a space program almost overnight, and 12 years later, we were walking on the moon. They did doctor up photos and stuff for the public, and they did use some of the Hollywood people that have been used for 2001 Space Odyssey. Uh, I have that from all the sources, NASA, Kubrick, family, all of it. I mean, we've got the contacts. It's all well known. I talked to the president. I don't need to go any further. You're getting what's really going on here. The human soul yearns for discovery by unlocking the mysteries of the universe. We unlock truths within ourselves. That's true. Yes, all closer together. Wouldn't that be nice? Can you believe that space is going to do that? I thought politics would do that. Well, we'll have to rely on space instead. Every launch into the skies is another step forward toward a future where our differences seem small. With the flat Earth thing, is that something that you truly really believe? The flat Earth. The flat Earth. The flat Earth. The flat Earth. Kyrie thinks the world is flat. The flat Earth. It's so beautiful.